folks, you're looking at the ugliest and one of the coolest looking metals that we offer here at Lucitaria. This is strontium. Strontium is a metal that is it has several other properties that I'm not going to bore you with, but the one main one that I think uh, those who collect elements will care about is the fact that it oxidizes in air and it turns ugly. As you can see here, this is, uh, if you order just straight up 10 grams or it's about 15 grams here, of strontium metal this is what you're gonna get this is quite ugly I admit this is uh, dendritic distilled strontium metal and superficially it looks kinda gray uh, you know, it looks like I don't know metallic cereal out of a box maybe uh, but it's not gonna stay like this if I leave it out for much longer it's just gonna start turning this uh, shade of light gray and then eventually white and disintegrate completely this is an oil and even the oil gets all slimy and yellowish uh, i need to tell you that even in oil it continues to degrade when this came out of the factory it was shiny briefly and even in the oil it continues to degrade how is that possible well the fact is that oil uh, is uh, permeable to oxygen and uh, small amounts of oxygen still get inside the oil and then it comes in contact with the strontium metal and it starts tarnishing it. The advantage of course is that you might have this in this state for many years before it crumbles into sludge which is what would happen under oil. Now on the other hand we have strontium metal and here you get to see what how beautiful this thing looks if you keep it under argon gas or any inert gas but argon is the cheapest lab gas that uh, nothing will react with so uh, this is the same stuff it's just in a in a different storage uh, means and unfortunately this, which is probably uh, about three to five grams, I'm not sure, uh, is going to cost much more than this 10 grams or 20 grams, whatever this says here. I didn't count it, but uh, that's this is about, I'd say, 15 grams. Let's uh, give or take a couple of grams. Uh, here you have somewhere between three and five grams. I think this is five grams. Uh, beautiful metal but it's almost impossible to keep it nice and shiny uh, because the smallest amount of oxygen will tarnish it so you have to have a very stringently manicured glove box that has uh, the low parts per million of, of, of oxygen in order to keep strontium oxide free uh, so you're paying a lot for that uh, sort of prep work and the fact that it has to be uh, turned into these uh, ampules. Uh, that's why it's so much more costly. But uh, strontium itself is not terribly expensive. I want to say it's about $500 a kilogram if you buy it in, in kilo quantities in a big drums. Uh, this lab stuff, of course, isn't because that gets a whole different treatment. I think it starts out in drums, but then they um, melt it in a furnace uh, that is vacuum. There's no nothing in the, in the vacuum chamber, and that keeps it oxygen-free, and it keeps it nice and shiny. And then they can just slice off little pieces of it while still keeping it you know, it transfers from the vacuum furnace into a glove box uh, that is bathed in argon constantly. And that's how you get that. So hopefully this is of interest to some of you. If you have questions, uh, let me know. This is Raciel for Luciteria. Thank you.